Hi, my name is Mr. Riley, and I want to welcome you this year to my Algebra 2 class. I want to make you uh, briefly aware of a few things uh, this year that's, that uh, uh, may be happening. First, you should have seen this document come home. It is the class syllabus. Uh, within that, it contains uh, grading information, uh, basic uh, classroom expectations. Uh, along with that, um, on the bottom back page, uh, I need to have a parent or guardian sign the acknowledgement of these expectations. And then uh, your student should bring that back to me. So that needs to happen uh, relatively quickly. Uh, second, if a student needs extra help, I am always here, uh, usually in the mornings about 7.15, 7.20 a.m. They can come in uh, before school. Uh, I do have B lunch, so if they need help during lunch, they could stop in. I'm usually here in my classroom uh, or after school. Uh, normally, I don't leave until uh, probably around 3.45, maybe 4 o'clock, uh, unless a student does stop in for extra help, then I will just stay as, as long as I need to, usually as late as 5 o'clock. Um, so there is that availability for extra help after school. The next thing. I put all my instructional material on Google Classroom, which you see behind me. Um, the instruction, instructional material consists of uh, my PowerPoint, which would also be considered as my notes for the student. Uh, oftentimes, you will see an instructional video for specific examples. And then finally, there's the homework problems. Um, so all of that information is on Google Classroom. Uh, your student does not need a textbook. However, if they feel more comfortable utilizing a textbook, uh, all they need to do is come to me and ask me and I will be happy to issue them a textbook. Um, so that's Google Classroom. Um, also, I have instructed the students on Google Classroom. When they become a, a student of mine or in my Google Classroom, I ask them to invite you, the parent or guardian, to my Google Classroom. That way, you can see all of the instructional material and all the information on that uh, website. Um, finally, or not finally, but next up would be grades. I post grades at the end of each week. So that would be uh, helpful for you to know. So each week you could get on uh, PowerSchool and check the updated grades of your student. Um, also, I would uh, add that uh, there is a place on PowerSchool that you can select that will notify you via email or text message. They will uh, notify you every time I uh, update your students' grades. So you might look into that. That way you know not only information when I load grades in, but whenever any other teacher here loads your students' grades in, uh, you could get an email message that that's been done. Finally, please feel free to email me if you have any questions or concerns. Um, I will try to answer those emails as quickly as I can. So please feel free to email me. Um, and then uh, that's it. Uh, I hope you have a really great day. And I look forward to working with your student this year.